dear biology aspirants right now i have the human circulatory system and uh, in, in this uh, section uh, we will discuss regarding the heart and uh, human circulatory system also called the blood vascular system consists of muscular chamber heart and uh, a network of closed branching blood vessels and blood the fluid which is circulated here you will see the heart is a mesodermally derived organ is situated in <coughs> the thoracic cavity in between the two lungs slightly tilted to the left it has it has the size of a clenched fist and it is protected by the double walled membranous bag pericardium it is known as pericardium uh, closing the pericardial fluid our heart has four chambers how many chambers four chambers two relatively small upper chambers called the atria <coughs> uh, where is the thick walled the inner ventricle septum separates the left and the right ventricles figure 18.2 the atrium and the ventricle of the same site are also separated by a thick fibrous tissue called called the atrioventricular septum however each of these septa are provided with an opening through which the two chambers of the same side are connected same side are connected the opening uh, between the right atrium and the right ventricle is guarded by a wall formed of three muscular flaps or cusps the tricuspid valve whereas a bicuspid valve or mitral valve guards the opening between the left atrium and the left ventricle you will see here uh, i would like to ask you the opening of the right and the left ventricle uh, into the pulmonary artery and the aorta respectively are provided with the semi lunar valves the contents are here the valves in the heart allows the flow of blood only in one direction which direction one direction i form the atria and the ventricle and form the ventricles to the pulmonary artery or aorta these valves prevent any backward flow so one word flow one side flowing the entire heart is made of uh, cardiac muscles which muscles cardiac the wall of ventricles are much thicker than that of the atria wall of wall is thicker a specialized cardiac muscular uh, muscular called the uh, nodal tissue is also distributed in the heart figure 18.2 will provide you the information patch of this tissue is present in the right upper corner of the right atrium called the sinoatrial node san another mass is another mass of this tissue is seen in the lower left corner of the right atrium close to the atrioventricular septum called the atrioventricular node AVN a bundle of uh, nodal fibers atrioventricular bundle AV bundle continues from the AVN which is which passes through the atrioventricular septa to emerge on emerge on the top of the interventricular septum and immediately divide it divides into right and left bundle these branches gave rise to minute fiber throughout the ventricular muscular of the respective sides and are called the purkinje fibers the nodal muscular uh, musculature has the ability to generate action potential with without any external stimuli i.e it is uh, auto excitable however the number of action potential that could that could be generated in a minute to very different parts of the nodal system the sand can generate the maximum number of action 
potentials are E70 to 75 minute and is responsible for initiating and uh, maintaining the rhythmic contractile activity of the heart so 70 to 75 therefore it is called the pacemaker our heart normally beats 70 to 75 times in a minute average 72 beats minute per minute so previous text is here and uh, for maintaining the heart it is very important to eat the less um, fatty items in the market and the fast food also avoid because uh, the daily lives will be the routine routinely and a routine life will provide you the healthy heart eat uh, every time the fibrous food and uh, avoid uh, fatty items lipids and highly uh, spicy items should not be eaten so it is our uh, responsibility for for responsibility for ourselves that we keep maintain our heart because the the tubes uh, artery and veins are very small and when the blood when you eat the most fatty items uh, uh, easy red meat like this and the highly dry, fr dry fruits high dry fruits then fat will be made in the blood and blood um, not flowing the free so i would like to ask you that maintain our heart every day and uh, eating habits should be changed so the fast food should not be eaten every day the routine difference will be made by ourselves so that is the important thing of our body the basic thing so it is located in the in between the two lungs tilted in the left side so when the blood flow in every part of body freely then every the organs every organ will work perfectly so we will meet in the next session with lot more till then thank you thanks for watching the video and section of human heart will provide you the nomenclature also four chamber heart we will meet next time with a lot more till then thank you thank you very much